kind of like you clean your house, right? Don't you get right. embarrassed when people come over and it's dirty? Right, yeah. Keep the earth clean too. That's our house. That is our house. Keep it clean. Let's not be embarrassing, you guys. <laughs> Plus, we like these. We want her to treat us right. Mother Nature. She gave us a good day yesterday. 76 degrees here into Green Bay. 75 into Appleton. Watoma, Wapaka, once again, taking on those 80s. Here for us this morning, still waking up to some nice heat. 69 degrees here into Green Bay. 75 into Chicago right now. We're seeing some low 70s as well into Manitowoc, Oshkosh, and Fond du Lac. Upper 50s into Kiwani. Now we can see those dew points are still muggy, 63 degrees. Notice that's not far from the same exact dew points down in the Gulf of Mexico. Yeah, we are feeling that Gulf moisture here all day today. It's only going to get worse. Winds out of the south right now up to 15 miles per hour. We did see some storms roll through this morning, through those early morning hours from about 2.30 to 4.30 or so. Now we're still seeing a few down into Manitowoc, also into Sturgeon Bay and throughout Door County. You can see that came across the bay. It did put down a little bit of hail into the Northwoods on the smaller scale of things, but a little bit bigger, possibly nickel size, just north of Manitowoc, also into Centerville as well. Thankfully, those are starting to push over the lake now. In terms of rainfall, about a half an inch. Some areas picked up about an inch pretty quickly there. So you could have seen some localized flash flooding ongoing. As we go through our day today, this is what's happening. That warm front comes right back. So by this afternoon, winds gusting up to about 25 miles per hour out of the south. South wind is a good wind if we want to shatter this record high of 87 degrees. That was set back in 90. One. So let's do it. Here we go. Our high temperatures today are expected to hit 90 degrees here into Green Bay all through the Northwoods. If you want the free AC, this is where you're going to go. Head to Lake Michigan. So let's talk about the days in the 90s. How many have we actually had? Well, in 2019, we had two. Otherwise, this is rare. So here we are making history here into Green Bay, but it's going to be very oppressive and honestly very miserable as well. Dew points hitting into those low to mid 70s. That is Ugh, very uncomfortable. So our heat index is going to be approaching the mid to upper 90s. So we are definitely going to be sweating today, thinking about how to cool down. Your beach forecast will only be about 75 degrees as a high temperature by Lake Michigan. We're also seeing a high UV index. Don't forget that sunscreen. Rip currents are also possible as well. If you get stuck in one of those, swim parallel to the shoreline. Also, we're going to see waves at about three to five feet high and the water is still cold at about 50 degrees. So keep that in mind. As we go through our day, a few more scattered showers and storms possible by the lake. A few clouds hanging on as everybody else starts to get bright, beautiful, hot and humid and windy. Thank goodness there's going to be a 25 mile per hour wind to hopefully cool us down, but nothing going on today. Maybe a few storms up into the north woods as you go to bed tonight, but otherwise tomorrow is looking bright, beautiful and sunny as well. We start off hot and humid before that cold front slams right into us tomorrow evening. So that puts us right back into a slight risk for strong to severe storms tomorrow night. Again, we could see a tornado pop Possible hail, large hail, and some damaging wind gusts, plus another one to one and a half inches of downpours, so potentially some localized flooding. So tomorrow, hot, humid, sunny start throughout the afternoon. After 2 p.m., look off to the west. Those storms are going to start to fire up, be isolated at first, potentially severe. They could line up as they go through the Fox Valley around 6 to 8, and they also look to try to stay over to our western area and not even migrate to the Fox Valley. I'll tell you why. We have a stalled out front as we go through that. So right now, patchy fog out there, rainy roads. Grab those rain boots for the morning hours. No jacket needed out there today. And of course, get ready to sweat. Stay hydrated. Highs of 90 degrees. We're going to break some records tonight. Stay mild into those mid to upper 60s overnight. The AC is going to need to start running, right? Tomorrow we're going to be back into those mid to upper 80s and then also low 90s potentially as well with those storms firing up into those evening hours. We have storm chances once again Saturday night as well. Notice our temperatures slowly start to cool. That humidity also slowly starts to leave us as well. And as we go into next week, we're going to actually see some below average temperatures by Wednesday highs back into those upper 50s. So a week long warm up and it's gone. Oh, I'm okay breaking records today. This is yeah. exciting. Isn't Today's going to be history? a good day. Let's yeah. focus on today. Absolutely. Thank you, Brittany. You're welcome. Come